Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to use the task motor for the metal firmware to use by the A4 board. And this is the ESP32 board. Uh, you can use the metal firmware for many Kinkonis ESP32 board because the task motor have support the metal firmware now. So in this video I will show you how to use this Apple HomeKit local country by the relay uh, for this Apple iPhone. So because you need to use the Apple Home port, or you can use the Apple TV or Apple iPad or work as a hub. So you can see I have prepared the mini home port. Okay, let's look at the step by step how to download the firmware for the task motor. And you can use the iPhone by the home kit. And you can see this is the task motor official website. And you can see this is the matter, but the matter protocol have support development now so it's not a final version just for development so we can download the metal firmware you can see uh, just by the ESP32 uh, by the serial port so you can see I can click uh, this one uh, for web install so I can click that choose our official the ESP32 chip and this is the metal just click this one metal and connect now you can connect with the a4 board uh, to the usb cable and this is the power supply i use the 12 volt you can connect it so let's look at the computer and you will see that have a usb com4 help detect uh, maybe you have another COM port number so we can click connect so that will connect to the A4 board and install Tasmota Met English version so click this one and if you want to uh, use the device just click this one and click the next and confirm install so now you can wait for a moment that the firmware have been downloaded to the ESP32 Okay, you can see the install is complete. We can click next. And the next step is configure the Wi-Fi, SSID, and the password. I can click, that is Kinkoni, and this is the password. And connection. Okay, you can see that is connected to the Wi-Fi. And the visit device, uh, this is the local IP address, and we can configure the task motor firstly. So you can click configuration, and you can see here have the item for the matter. But at the first, we need to configure the relay output because we can see that have four channel relay output, so we can use the home kit to control this relay output on and off. So you can configure the module and uh, find the GPIO pins for the A4 board you can see here is the ESP32 GPIO for the A4 board you can check in our form, technical support form so there are four channel relay this relay 1 is GPIO 2 and relay 2 is 15 and relay 3 is 5 and relay 4 is 4 so you can see I have copy and paste here so we can just fill and uh, click uh, relay 1 is GPIO 2 uh, this is relay 1 so we can choose this one relay 1 and the second is 15 GPIO 15 that have the relay second and this is 3 is 5 3 is f and the 4 that is 4 We can click for okay we can click save and go to the main menu because the module will be restart okay now you can see that have the four buttons on the task motor you can click that will be on and off
So you can see I can turn on this four channel relay for on and off. Now we will configure the matter. So we can click configuration and this time we can click this matter item. So we can click this one and click enable the matter and press save button. And also the ESP32 will be reboot and click main menu. And this time you will see this QR code and this QR code we will use by the Apple HomeKit. And here you can see that is the Apple HomeKit. So I can click add and scan successfully. You can see I can scan this QR code and add to Apple Home. And now you can see that have select the location for the board. So I have choose the bedroom and continue. And this you can see that have assured the matter. Continue. And continue. And uh, this have detect the four. You can see uh, that have four outlets because we can rename and change the icon later. So I can click continue and also the bedroom continue and just continue. We can click the light and continue. Also the bedroom. Okay, you can see the four outlets have added to my home. So you can click and uh, this time you can see that have four icons displayed. And the four channel is on. Click. Also you can see that will be on and off. And if you want to rename uh, such as uh, I can rename to light one, light one, and the icon you can change by yourself. And this is light one, so you can see I can click. Now you can see the name have renamed to the light one. So also you can use a uh, Siri. Hey Siri, turn on light one. Okay, which room? Default room or bedroom? Bedroom. Okay, you can see the bedroom, the city have turned on the all lights. So also you can turn off uh, uh, this. Maybe you can rename uh, for different names. So this is just uh, show you how to use the Siri voice country by the home kit. Okay, this is A4 board. Also you can use the metal freeware uh, for ESP32 other series, A series board. Uh, thanks for watching.